Temps go back up to the triple digits. The heat can turn dangerous. We know this, especially for those without a home or AC. So starting today, St. Vincent de Paul is providing some relief. Team 12's Brian West is live in downtown this morning. Brian, what are they doing to help out? Good morning, Paul and Emma. Well, they are handing out water to the community. I want to show you, you were talking about those triple digits. Take a look at that 35 degrees. This is the water cooler here at St. Vincent de Paul, where they are storing a lot of that water that they're going to be handing out. We have Danielle here with the organization. Tell me about this program, third or fourth year. Yeah, so St. Vincent de Paul does water relief and heat relief all throughout the county. Uh, we have our Celebrity Fight Night water truck that goes out and delivers water to people in the community where they're at. Uh, we have our five dining rooms also that open for extended hours and hand out water all day long to our guests. And how does it work? We're looking at video right now of the water truck. So every day this is going out into the community. Yeah, every day they go out into rural areas of the community where services aren't quite being met and hand out water and basic need items to all the individuals that they encounter that are living out on the street. And you need donations. We do. Uh, we can't meet enough of our needs with water for all of our guests. We need water donations. They can be brought to any of our dining rooms, any of our St. Vincent de Paul sites. Um, you also can always come out and volunteer. Summertime is a tough time for us to get people to come out and serve, so we can always use helping hands. Uh, we also have our website, summerrelief.org, so if you want to donate, you can visit us online um, and help us with our water efforts. And one more time, what's the website? Summerrelief.org. There you go. Guys, I'm going to stay in here all summer. This 35 degrees is very nice. So about 630, they're going to be picking up the water and then heading out into the community. So we will have an update for you then. Until now, we're reporting live. Brian West, 12 News. Gosh, we're so thankful for places like that. Thank you so much, Brian. Five